is driving me batty. Agatha, I'll check on supper. Drat! I use too much Tabasco sauce. <laughs> hey, Drac, what's your favorite part of a train, huh? Huh? The boxcar! <laughs> I shall kiss it and make it all better. Oh, that feels better. Hey, Sabrina, what did the shovel say to the ditch? I don't know. What? You're too deep for me. I'll dig you later. Frank, do you get fur from the abominable snowman? Why, yes. As far as I can. <laughs> well, my friends, it's time to do our annual haunted house cleaning. Right, Drac. If we all pitch in, we'll soon have this place looking spook and span. Groovy, Drac baby, groovy. I shall handle the walls. And I'll take care of the floors. And I'll tend to the ceiling. I hope he doesn't come down with housemaid's wing. Now, dig. The first thing that's got to go is this cobweb. <laughs> Stubborn little thing. What do you think you're doing? Uh, just like tidying up a bit. I'll teach you, you home wrecker. <laughs> like I'm all wrapped up. <laughs> he thinks he's all wrapped up. <laughs> oh, boy. This should help you with your spring cleaning. Have you gone completely bats? Why, no. More like bugs. Looks like you fellas can use a hand. I'll knuckle down to wake right now. Sorry, mummy. This is an emergency. This should do it. You didn't know I used to be a cow hand. Goulahan, you're marvelous. Allow me to shake your body. Always glad to lend a hand, Count. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got a date with a lady finger. <laughs> Get it, pal? Snack time, Orville. Some goodies for you. Orville's got a terrible sweep tooth. Ho, 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 ho. So, taking my broom without permission, eh? That's the last straw. Sick of broom, Hilda. <laughs> you nincompoop, what are we going to do about the chandelier? Feed it to Orville. <laughs> You know, man, washing my wolf wagon should be easier than cleaning the lobby, because Frankie won't be helping. Uh, uh, that darn wolf wagon always hides itself when, like, it's time for his bath. Aha! I know how to find him. This is his favorite grade of oil. Here, boy, look what I got for you, man. You know, so it shouldn't be like a total loss. Yeah, whoop, yeah, whoop, yeah, whoop. Ah, ah, ah. All right, children, time again for Dracula's little red ghoul house. Today, we take up the subject of bones. And here to teach us about bones is our good friend, Bone of Art. Oh, watch this. Looks like Bonaparte put his foot in that time. <laughs> Why, you little monsters! Betty, what 
any cracker. <laughs> Up to your old skull dog of me, eh? Just will I get my hands on you if I can find them. <laughs> My bones! I'm in one piece again! I always say there's nothing like a short trip to pull yourself together. <laughs> well, students, what have you learned about bones? Oh, they hurt. <laughs> Three great big ghouls who are the best of friends And they live in the old haunted mansion Past where the dirt road ends Whenever they go out together It is a sight to see Because there's frightening Frankie A dangerous dragon Heaven of all, whenever it's time for scaring, they're all for one and one for all. Whenever they go out together, it is a sight to see, because there's frightening Frankie, a dangerous dragon. Why is Christmas like Wolfie at the beach? <laughs> because they both have Sandy Claus! <laughs> Bonaparte, I hear you've taken up bowling. That's right, Sabrina. Watch this. Hey, that's pretty good. Well, where do you go? I got a spare. <laughs> Birthday, Wolfie! Happy birthday, Wolfie! <laughs> hey, like just what I've always wished! A punch bowl! <laughs> My favorite proverb is, a witch in time saves nine! <laughs> Mine is, 
a ghoul and his mummy are soon parted. <laughs> you know. <laughs> oh, boy. That's a good one. <laughs> My favorite is all work and no play makes Drac a dull bat. <laughs> Happy birthday, Wolfie. <laughs> Happy birthday, Wolfie. Another, just what I always wanted, a punching bag. <laughs> uh, ask it, ask it. How can I get to the zombies' picnic? If you're lucky, you won't get there. <laughs> There's not enough room in here to swing a bat. Don't worry, I shall make it bigger. <laughs> Golly, Jupiter, now the feeling's too low. Happy birthday, Wolfie. <laughs> Happy birthday, Wolfie. I'm gone, man. Just what I like always wanted. A pair of socks. <laughs> Time now for Bella's horoscope. Oh, Bella, what's my horoscope? The stars say from now on, life will be a bowl of cherries. Are you quite, quite sure? <laughs> Would I lie to you? <laughs> Happy birthday, Wolfie. Happy birthday, Wolfie. <laughs> Again, what I always desired, a genuine alligator belt. <laughs> Dr. Jekyll and Hyde, my weird uncle thinks he's a lawnmower. Well, bring him around. I can't. The neighbors just borrowed him. <laughs> Help! A giant tarantula just bit me finger. Which one? Who knows? All those giant tarantulas look alike to me. <laughs> what are you doing, Agatha? Watering my morning glories. <laughs> Bella Lagosla here. Got a hang up? We'll be a smart fella and tell it to Bella. Hello, Miss Bella. Why, Tiny, what's your problem? It's my wife, Missy. She's a lovely uh, <laughs> creature in such a gorgeous blue eye. That's the whole problem. Everywhere we go, that eye is staring at me. Please, Miss Bella, you've got to help me. I know just what steps will stop the stairs. Anything. Oh, just sing to Missy. When you sing, it's always a hair-raising experience. <laughs> Right, if you say so. Come slip slop through the swamp weed. I'll take Tom Bones anytime. Through the marsh gas, past the haunted tree. You call that singing? <laughs> Why, he can barely carry a tomb. Come slip slop through the swamp weed. <laughs> That is sung in four flats. <laughs> With me. There. Now you can get some shut eye. When you sing, it's always a hair-raising experience. <laughs> tiny, tiny, sure pull the wool over her eyes. <laughs> there. It's finished. This handstand is going to come in real handy. <laughs> Is there a doctor in the house? There's a doctor. Jekyll and Hyde. I hurt my finger. Which one? I'd show you, but it's not polite to paint. <laughs> Got a hand at the Gula hand. He is well bred. Hurt your hand, you say? Right. In that case, my partner will attend to you. I only handle left. First, I test your reflexes. Sit down and cross your fingers. I hope you got a kick out of that, Hyde. Hyde, I am Jekyll. You are Hyde. The heck you are! Oh, yeah? Forget it, Doc. The 
this is one hand you'll never lay a finger on. It looks like Goulahan turned thumbs down on Jekyll and Hyde. Now to mail this package to my sister, Nagatha. Oh, she just loves dragonfly pie. <coughs> Maybe this will tickle your fancy. <laughs> I know. How about a few more stats? Our age? Playing post office? Okay. If you don't like dragonfly pie, I know someone who does. My witch's cat and howling dog changed this mailbox into a frog. <laughs> now that package will need special handling, man, so you will not get what? Here, yeah, boy. <laughs> they don't call me Hackathon the Hexpert for nothing. <laughs> Looks like the U.S. male is no match for a U.S. female. <laughs> <laughs> I need a man. Man, like that bare bones is the ghoulest. They're about to offer us something fortissimo if you are peggios and some pizzicato. That Italian food always gives me heartburn. You see what I mean? Faster than a speeding ghoulie! More powerful than a loco monster! Able to leap haunted houses in a single bow wow! oh. It's a weirdo! It's a diggerling! It's super ghoul! <laughs> A goblin is in trouble. They call on Super Goo. And he's there in a minute, right on time, to enforce the Ghouly Rule. Scare unto others, as you would have others scare unto you. Saving little ghouls. If you get in trouble and need his help, call out the ghouly rule. Scare unto others, as you would have others scare unto you. Songs in 